is again very similar to the previous one okay so over here you can see so there are points a b and c okay out of this a b c point a point is fixed okay it will not move in any case okay then b point is there which is the moving spindle or you can say moving block okay so it is a floating block and c is nothing but the reed okay so in this case what is happening so spindle is here okay what is the function of spindle so spindle will give you or it is the part which takes or which gives input to the instrument or which gives input to this comparator okay so over here you can see the spindle displacement is shown okay so as the spindle displaces up and down then what will happen so the displacement is fed to the reeds okay and there is those reeds are connected or those reeds are in contact with the floating block b okay so as the spindle moves up and down the displacement is taken or the dis displacement is traced by the spindle will be given to the reeds and those reeds will give the same displacement to the floating block okay and because of that what will happen so here you can see two rods okay denoted with the help of the alphabet d okay hatching lines are there so out of this one rod is connected to a point and second rod is connected to the b point okay because of this what will happen so and one horizontal line is here over here you can see one horizontal line because of that what will happen so one part will remain fixed and another part will give displacement so because of that what will happen this kind of shape happens or this kind of uh, signal is given to the pointer okay or given to the linkages and those linkages will displace this pointer okay so over here in this diagram you can see first of all a b and c are at its original position okay because when a b and c are at original positions the pointer is at zero okay and after giving the displacement to the spindle what is happening you can see some dotted lines in this b and c or in this square block you can see uh, dotted lines so dotted lines is nothing but the second position of the spindle okay so as the spindle moves up and down so these are the dotted lines which are uh, the displacement of b and c okay and because of that what will happen the pointer will get deflected to this position okay so the uh, these dark lines are nothing but original position of this reed type comparator and the dotted lines over here uh, again you can see uh, one horizontal dotted line is there then these inclined dotted lines are there okay so these are the uh, these are the displacements of the c and b points when the displacement is given to the spindle okay and because of that what will happen the spindle will sorry the pointer will move in either of the directions okay either here or here okay, depending upon the type of displacement given to this reed type of comparator okay so reed type of comparator uses a frictional less reed mechanism okay for magnifying small motions of the spindle okay very small displacements are also taken or very small displacements are also recorded with the help of this reed type of mechanism okay and you can get the 
वैल्यू ऑफ दी डिस्प्लेसमेंट इन द फॉर्म ऑफ रोटेशनल मोशन एंड यू कैन इजीली फाइंड हाउ मच इज द रीडिंग ऑन द सर्क्यूलर स्केल ओके शोन बाय द पॉइंटर देन